Hey guys, it's Brooke. Before the video starts, I'd like to mention that this video does contain ticks, clowns, and fake blood. So if any of that's gonna bother you, I do recommend you click off. Um, cause I have plenty of other videos that don't have like weird special effects stuff and are short enough that I don't really tick in them. So that's your one warning. Please enjoy. It has been so long since I recorded everything. I have been off YouTube for like forever <laughs> because I tried to move and get a job. That didn't work out, so I had to move back, and uh, <laughs> a lot of drama happened, but that's story for another day. Point is, I'm back. I want to try to start uploading regularly again. Let's see how well that works. Um, so, <laughs> the point of this video is my aunt for Christmas has gotten me a special effects makeup kit and <laughs> I'm super excited about it <laughs> I it comes with like all this stuff you know brushes for face paint uh there's coagulated blood gel sponge scar wax which I'm super excited about and <laughs> this thing used to apply the wax so I'm sitting here just got this and I'm thinking well I want to test it all out but I'm a bit too lazy to do like six different looks <laughs> oh crap I didn't clean that anyway that's <laughs> anyway, yeah, I'm a bit too lazy to do like six different looks to try everything out. So I'm sitting here thinking, what character could I do? And I've been really into the Magnus Archive lately. If you've seen my video o videos over the past few months, it's like 80% Michael Shelley. <laughs> so I'm thinking... We're not doing a full cosplay, but because I don't have the stuff for it, but I'm gonna do Nikola Arsenov because she is the only character I could think of that can incorporate face paint, blood, and scar wax. So, go ahead into the other room. The lighting in there is terrible. Let's see if I could fix that, but like, yeah, then I'm gonna start doing the look. Okay, I didn't mean to do time lapse, but I did, and honestly, that's probably for the better. I had a lot of trouble using the scar wax, because it's my first time and I have no idea how it works. And I think I was allergic to the fake blood, but I think it turned out alright. You don't sound Russian? How could I sound anything, silly? I'm plastic! I don't even have a voice box. I had to borrow this one. Uh. Okay, so that was my finished Nikola Orsonov <laughs> makeup look. Again, I did have a lot of tr trouble with the scar wax. Um, it was like really hard and difficult to put on and didn't stick at all. So if there's any more experienced makeup artists in the comments, Please, please tell me what to do because I I didn't even bother googling it. I won't lie. Like I've I've looked into stuff like this before, but I was confused. <laughs> now that I actually have it, I expected it to be softer. Scar wax is like I don't know. It's really tough. I don't know what to describe the consistency as. <laughs> also, the face paint had like a surprisingly good coverage that I did not expect because I normally ask for cheap stuff and you know, when you buy cheap, you get cheap. 
So, yeah. But, like, for, like, a one-night thing that I had on for maybe five minutes, and as a first-time tryout of trying to do that type of special effects, you know, something more than just Stauber's glue and eyeshadow, I'm pretty proud of it. <laughs> but, yeah, that's the video. I, I do hope to upload more, but other than that, bye!